So I get a lot of questions about what I feed my dubia roaches because whenever I post them on Instagram, uh, everybody always asks. And so here we go. You need a banana to start. Then you just make it naked. For the demonstration purposes of this video, we're only going to use half of the banana, so you're just going to cut it in half, like that. Now while I am using half of the bananas for my dubia roaches, I am giving the other half to my katydids so that they can have a nice, delicious feast. Next, you're going to need three things. First, a dubia bin. Second, some pangea. It can be whatever flavor you want. Next, and lastly, you're going to need some cichlid pellets. I like to use these because they have protein, veggies, minerals, and they're cheap, and I got them from Amazon. Thank you, Jeff Bezos. And now the last part, which is the easiest. First, you're going to add a banana over onto your food dish. Then, you're going to add some cichlid pellets. And finally, you're going to top it off with a nice dusting of Pangea. So this is post-production Alex here, and I just wanted to add in that I give them this mixture of banana, cichlid pellets, and Pangea about two times a week, usually three days before I actually feed them off and harvest some for my pets to feed off. It works out really well, and they've been producing very nicely for me. As you can see, they really enjoy it as well. So there you have it. That's my little secret on how I feed my dubia roaches and how I get them piling on food like this. And again, I feed them pretty often, but they just really like this a lot. If you enjoyed this short little video, let me know in the comments and I'll gladly make more. It was very not time-consuming to make and uh, yeah, pretty fun.